So today, Ricky and I are at a house. Actually, we're at Andy's house, our cameraman. It's his son's birthday, and he's having a Minecraft birthday party. And a little later, we're going to be seeing a video game truck pulling up to his house. So we'll check it out when it comes. About midway through the party, Ricky and I decide to go to Savers, and also, we end up doing a deal, so we snuck out for about an hour. We're going to Savers right now. Ricky? I yeah. love Savers. You gonna find anything? All the time. We need a cameraman right now. We don't have one. They're all at the same birthday party right now. <laughs> Give it to Everly. She'll do it. Everly, back there. Can you film? Yeah, we're uh, we were supposed to go meet somebody right now to do some trades that we'll tell you about in a bit, but he called a little late. That's okay. So we're gonna go to Savers with like what 20 minutes. Your gas yeah. lights on, by the way. I know. What's up in gas? Not me personally, but Aaron. Hey. One thing we really like about Savers is that they haven't really caught on too much to the whole gaming retro craze. I know Goodwill definitely caught on and does auctions and kind of overprices. Savers seems to be right in the middle, so that's really cool. And even if they are aware of this, they seem to be pricing their stuff at a fairly good price for all of us out there. No games today. Unless you like Wii Rock Band. Wait, is this that really rare one? No. Isn't it the college one? I don't know, I know nothing about that. I don't want it, that's for sure. Last time I got it for $1.99. Aren't spinners very popular in your um, culture? Culture? Yeah, they were invented back in like 1700s by the Aztecs. Seriously? Yeah. Are you lying to me? Yeah. Did you ever want spinners? Really? I'm being no, serious. No. Seriously, no. You never debated no. it? No. Promise. Promise. Does anybody in your family have spinners? I think my one of my cousins does. Yes. <laughs> He did. Not anymore. Spinners are for winners. <laughs> So, so far we've made our way through most of the gaming stuff and haven't really found much. Will we find anything? How to get, it's how, like Call of Duty when you go like this. <laughs> how to get through the crowds at the swap meet. <laughs> Pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. Look at this. You remember back in the day when it was awesome to go like this? like. <laughs> Dude, that was like awesome for a long time. I was actually into that. The skater Chad Muska used to like did crooked, he skate with it? He used to like crooked grind like 15 stair handrails while holding one. So yeah, we ended up leaving Savers empty handed, but will we leave the day empty handed? Going to Sonic's to go do a trade with Lewis and Jacob from uh, Land of, uh, I can't even say it. Vintage Games and Toys. Land of Vintage Games and Toys. <laughs> Look at this, like, eh. <laughs> We're gonna do some trading. Technically, I was I wanted to buy, but he wants to trade, so it's always good to trade. Trading's always the best. Look at that Thundercat sweater. Thunder, Thundercat. All right, so Ricky won some auctions off of me, which was two Street Fighter games. Yes. And this. I love Street Fighter. Sick puppy, which is the Xbox Limited Edition Mountain Dew. which was a kind of a weird offering that they had where you had to collect so many points off of cans and stuff. You sent it in for an opportunity to win one of these. Then you got into a lottery. If they picked your name, then you got to get one of these. Damn. Yeah, it, complicated and tough. I'm already confused. So this Xbox is one of those items I see online all the time, but I've never seen in person. And I gotta admit, I'm pretty jealous of Ricky for getting this. Ricky's giving me his Nintendo telephone. It's the Mario Kart N64 telephone. Sick. It's missing the the, the steering wheel. And the steering wheel. That's that's fine. I'm gonna use it for decoration. Oh here you. This dude. Oh. 
That's an Atari Lynx. Atari Lynx. Is that a Game Boy? Yes. <laughs> Dude, these things are sick. Here, I even, it even came with the plug. Some kids would say, why is it so big? So Ricky gives Lewis some pretty cool stuff, and Lewis is one of those guys that's a reseller, but that we trust so much. We've done so much business with this guy, he wouldn't hurt us or harm us in any way in a deal. Whatever you want. All my NES are gone, bro. I don't have any Oh, left. you sold it all? You had a big sale, right? right. Three bucks, it, a pop or something yeah, like that? Yeah, I still got it going, right, going on right now, but it, it's basically gone. Super Nintendo didn't have too much. The only thing that's kind of rare is this King Arthur. It was kind of, it was pretty fun. I need that. Happy dance. <laughs> it is pretty sick, I gotta admit, I love this thing. When I saw it in the auction, I was like, I'm bidding. The real question is, do you actually like Mountain Dew? I like the red one. I actually love Mountain Dew. I like the red Mountain Dew. I like the fish. The aroma that we're getting here is, it's a wonderful bouquet, it's just beautiful. No? No bueno? What's your drink of toys? choice? Dr. Pepper. Oh. You know, give, give me a fist pump right now with baby in hand. That's what I'm talking about. That's the drink. Jacob, what about you? What's your drink of toys? Oh, you're the same. Just give me a fist bump right here. You don't even give my baby a fist bump. <laughs> She's like, don't touch me. It's like, what are you doing? Look at that sweater, though. I know. You gotta look at that sweater. You, know, you, gotta, you gotta see a shirt. Uh oh. You got what a shirt you got? on? Yeah. Unzip it. Oh, that is the good stuff. Let me get that. That's the one from today, the post. Yep. This game sucks. <laughs> it's real life. Where'd you get that? Um, um, at the mall. Let's get some shit. So I personally didn't pick anything up at all, and Ricky did walk away with some pretty cool stuff, but there's one thing I wish I would have gotten. Honestly, I'm pretty upset right now. What'd you think of that trade? What'd you get? I got nothing. I just came to support you. I brought my daughter. She was a little fussy, but a bottle helps her a lot. I, um, you know what I'm second guessing? That Pepsi thing we didn't pick up, that Pepsi boombox. Yeah, I, I feel like we should have got that. How much was that? I think it was like five bucks. We should have got it. We made a mistake. You could have got a Mountain Dew thing and a Pepsi thing. We could have called this episode like soda or something. Pepsi Cola? Sure. I caught you sleeping. <laughs> now we head back to the birthday party as we've been gone for about an hour and a half and we go look at the video game truck and I will just leave you guys with a montage of the truck, which was pretty cool. Talk to you guys next time here on another NES Pursuit. <laughs>